Hello and welcome to Raw Deal or Raw Deal. Because that's kind of what it is, isn't it? I mean, every choice you make, all roads lead to hell, motherfuckers, I'm afraid. So, break it down. How can something that's making you feel good, happy, be a raw deal? Well, you know, you fall in love with someone, you befriend someone. They'll suffer, they'll die. Or you'll suffer, you'll die. And either way, that's a raw deal, isn't it? I mean, you're making someone miserable. Yes. And what about you find something you like? Well, you've got to do that in moderation because if it's food, if you eat too much of it, it'll make you fat. might give you cancer if you don't do it in uh, a sensible fashion. But then you think about who made that food. <laughs> you can spiral out of control on this. You can. They say don't think too deeply. Oh, you're thinking too deeply. Well, I don't think people think enough. I mean, that sandwich you're enjoying... <laughs> it's probably made by some underpaid immigrant. Some woman who was struggling to feed her children at home. Somebody with aspirations for giving their, their replicates a better life than they had. So they're working some shitty job making you your... Fucking posh vegan sandwich. So that they can feed and clothe their growing replicas. In a dream. In an aspiration that. They'll have a wonderful life. Well we all know that's a fucking fantasy. I mean. You move to the next strata. You move to the next level. You're still dealing with shit. You're just wearing different clothes, driving different cars and living in different sized houses. Yeah. Raw deal or raw deal. You. <laughs> you're good at something. You're good at something. Well, eventually you'll fail. Eventually your faculties will let you down. You can kick a ball around, eventually your knees will give way, your hips will erode. You'll end up suffering for your art. You'll end up suffering. Your body will give way. Your mind will let you down. Raw deal or raw deal? Raw fucking deal. Tell me something in the comments, please. That isn't a raw deal. Once you're here, that is. Obviously, um, learning about antinatalism, I suppose, is <laughs> in some way, in some way, for some people, a enlightening procedure that causes happiness. Well, for me personally, it causes me happiness because I know that I will not be responsible for the suffering harm of of somebody, okay, by bringing them into this world. But there's a sadness attached to it as well for me, for many people, that this is the way it is. We are victims of the raw deal and we wish it wasn't so. We wish, we wish so much, we wish so fucking much that we could create that wonderful utopia that fantasy land that imaginary imaginary place but we know we know it's not possible we know we know we're just um falling victim to the dangers of optimism so yeah sorry for the ramble but uh raw deal or raw deal you like animals? You like your doggy? Well, that poor little fuck has been bred by thousands of years of husbandry, 
forced by humans to <laughs> exist for our enjoyment, for our protection. Finally tuned by human selection, selecting which dogs get to fuck. And that poor little fucker's really useless without you. Completely dependent on you. Needs you to walk it, needs you to feed it. Need you to take it to the vet. And you know what? It too will fucking die. That little ball of fluff that you fucking love so much. That's so happy to see you. Even though you probably don't deserve it because you're probably a cunt. I mean, they just love us, these animals. These dogs. Yeah, they've had a fucking raw deal. A very raw deal. They are the true modern day slaves. That's not to say there aren't other modern day slaves, but yes. Human slaves, that is. Yes. 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 I'll leave it there. <laughs> I'll leave it there. Thank you for listening. I know that one was all over the place, but... Fuck. Fuck. How could you be well? How could you be well? Thank you. Bye-bye for now.